bird. I don't know. Pretty hard what? Opponent. To... Oh, the red squirrels. Yeah, yeah. yeah. of living in my studio one time in an old um, mill and uh, the squirrels broke in one day and they walked over everything and so all my paintings had these tracks in it. Oh neat! <laughs> so you have your own studio then? I did. I had, I have had several studios. Um, and did you sell your paintings? Mm -hmm. oh, very cool. I'll have to send you some of them. We'll see. Portraits and people, mm. landscapes, things like that. You get lonely sometimes too. Yeah. Sometimes, but I always have my co computer mm -hmm. and my camera. So I'm once I have my camera, I talk to my camera, and then I'm not lonely anymore. Mm -hmm. But I I also have a car, so I can go anywhere. Mm -hmm.
What's that? I believe it's a... Well, I don't know. Flicker? Or a pileated woodpecker? Hmm. Or a hairy woodpecker? I can't remember. Hmm. Oh yeah, pileated woodpecker. Yeah, I just redid this part. Looks kind of messy, but it was all cut along the same line. Oh no, that's here. Are you using this one? Oh. I think I pulled it through the wrong way. Yeah, there's nothing in this one. This is empty. This is all skin. Well, it does a little bit more to do right here. Oh yeah, it doesn't look perfect because of the like because it was um, torn, mm -hmm. and so I went over the edge of it. And I redid this side too because I thought that was torn.
Well, there we go. That's a practice one anyway. And then you can you can oil this size and it'll turn a beautiful brown. Hmm. So I guess it's good for putting on the wall, right? For mm -hmm. holding things. Yep. So you should probably put some sort of a make a little put a root for hanging it on the wall. I think it's nice if you put like a thing this way and then you put a nail mm -hmm. on the wall and then you, yeah. you can put things like candles or even clothes pegs in. Yeah. Or something, you know. That's right. The container into which to put things. Mm -hmm.